Today we're taking a look at a rather unique product by Naked Armor, and that is their aftershave all-purpose balm. Naked Armor sells this aftershave balm in a hefty four-ounce glass container with a half-turn tin lid. Now this container is straight down on the inside, so once you get down to the end of this four ounce container, you're not going to be needing to try to get anything out of like the top rim of it because you'll be able to reach it all down at the bottom. The scent of this balm is, well, it's kind of an interesting one. To me, I smell a bit of citrus, a bit of eucalyptus, and a bit of all of the other natural scents that are in this from the ingredients list. Speaking of the ingredients, they are all natural, which is always a plus in my eyes. The ingredients in this balm are all natural, and they include sunflower seed oil, castor seed oil, cocoa butter, hemp oil, beeswax, vitamin E, rosemary, leaf oil, cypress oil, eucalyptus leaf oil, cedar oil, sandalwood oil, rosemary leaf extract, as well as calendula oil. Now to use this aftershave balm, make sure that you dry off your face and as well as your head if you are applying it there as well. Because of all the oils in this, it does not like to play well with the water that might be on your face. So once you got that all dried off, just take a very little bit of this, rub it in your hands in between your palms and apply it evenly to your face. Now I even applied some to my beard if I had any left over on my hands, as well as rubbed it into my hands to help moisturize those as well. Now as you heard, it has hemp oil in it. Now why would you add hemp oil to something like a aftershave? Well, there's a couple of really good reasons for that. And I think the main one, which kind of covers all of them, is that it is a great moisturizer that doesn't clog pores. If you get clogged pores from things that you're putting on your face, obviously you can get acne easier, you can get blemishes easier, and it can also help with overproduction of oils on your skin. When your skin gets too dried out, it can overproduce the natural oils that your body naturally produces. So with using a product that has hemp oil in it, it can help all around with helping your skin and your face look healthier. Hemp oil also has some natural healing abilities with a lot of omega-6 and omega-3 fatty acids in it. It can even help with things like eczema or really dry spots on your face or your skin. So it really is kind of an all-purpose balm. Now from my experience using Naked Armor's Aftershave Balm, well, like I said, this is unique. And two of the main reasons why it's unique is because one, it's an aftershave that is a balm, which I haven't tried any of those before. And honestly, I haven't even really seen that many of them before. So that is one reason why I say that this product is on the more unique side, as well as that hemp oil. Now, usually I'll use a product like this for about a month before I give you guys my input. And this one I've actually had in my possession and been using for about two months just because I wanted to make sure that I had enough usage cases in it that I could actually tell you guys my thoughts. And what I mean by that is Aftershave is one of those products that I do not use all of the time. It's just one of those products that I use when I notice that I will probably be needing some because either my skin's a little bit irritated, it's a little bit on the dry side, or really on the dry side. So I want to make sure that I had at least 15 to 20 uses of this up. And it may not look like I've used it that much, but guys, this stuff really does not take much to moisturize even your head and your face with it. So I think that this four ounces should last you a good long time. Of things that I'm not a huge fan of about this balm. One of them is the scent. It seems like it's a little bit on the strong side for me. However, it does dissipate fairly quickly within about that five to 10 minute range. I'd say that the second thing that I'm not a huge fan of is that even though it doesn't have petroleum jelly in it, it definitely has the same texture 
which I'm just not a fan of all around. Having that texture is a little bit odd for a balm. However, it definitely works and it does stay well on the skin and the head. Now, after you apply it to your skin, I did notice that it definitely adds a little bit more shine into your skin than what you might want. And it kind of does leave a little bit of a oily texture. However, that too dissipates as the oils are able to absorb into your skin to do their job. And do its job, it does that. I have noticed that my skin might be a little bit on the drier side and I'll take a shower and apply this and within a couple of hours my skin feels back to normal. Now I have also noticed that because it does have a beeswax in it, even though that it kind of sucks into the skin on my cheeks and my neck and stuff, it definitely leaves just a thick enough layer that it keeps my head rather shiny throughout the day. Which if that's the look that you're going for, this stuff may be right up your alley because it's not too thick, it's really easy to apply, and it does leave your head looking a little bit shiny. Now do I think that this would be worth your money? Well, quite honestly, I think that like a lot of Naked Armors products, it comes in a bit higher than what I would be willing to pay for it. Even though that it doesn't take much every use and it does come in a four ounce container, the price of this comes in at $37 and so it definitely comes in a little bit on the high side for me personally. However, if you are looking for something with some of that hemp oil in it, you're looking for something with a decent scent to it that dissipates quickly, or you're looking for something to help your head be a little bit shiny but not too shiny, I think that this may be worth it to you. To see more Naked Armor products that I've reviewed in the past, make sure to check out this playlist up here. Down below, that's going to be a video that you may enjoy as well. Until next time, as always, you have a good one.